Listen to this piece, then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Of the three sections in the music, which one was the loudest? The answer is the second section. Did the change from quiet to loud playing happen suddenly or gradually? The answer is suddenly. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the upper part played with mainly smooth or detached notes? The answer is detached. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down in the middle. Did the piece end in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major. Number two, listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Where was the quietest point in the music? The answer is at the end. Were the changes in loud and quiet playing sudden or gradual? The answer is gradual. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the piece played in a smooth or detached style? The answer is smooth. Did the speed of the music change at all or did it always stay the same? The answer is it stayed the same. Was the piece in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is minor. Number three, listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Where was the quietest part of the music? The answer is the middle. 
were the changes in loud and quiet playing, sudden or gradual. The answer is sudden. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the quiet phrase played with smooth or detached notes? The answer is smooth. Did the speed of the music change or did it always stay the same? The answer is it stayed the same. Was the piece in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major. Number four, listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Did the music begin loudly or quietly? The answer is loudly. Was the loudest point in the music reached suddenly or gradually? The answer is gradually. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the ending smooth? Or detached? The answer is smooth. Did the speed of the music change at all or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down near the end. Did the piece end in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major. Number five, listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Where was the loudest part of the music? The answer is, in the second half or towards the end. Was the loudest point reached by a sudden or a gradual change? The answer is, gradual. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the melody played with mainly smooth or detached notes?
The answer is smooth. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down towards the end. Did the music end in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is minor. Number 6. Listen to this piece, then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. The music began loudly. Did it stay loud throughout? The answer is no. The second half was quiet. Was the change from loud to quiet playing sudden or gradual? The answer is sudden. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Were the notes smooth or detached? The answer is detached. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down towards the end. Was the music in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major. Number 7. Listen to this piece, then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Which was louder, the first half of the piece or the second half? The answer is the first half. Was the change to very quiet playing made suddenly or gradually? The answer is gradually. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the playing smooth or detached? The answer is smooth. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down towards the end. Was the piece in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major. Number 8. Listen to this piece, then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes.
Where was the quietest point in the music? The answer is, at the end. Was the first change from quiet to loud playing sudden or gradual? The answer is, sudden. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Were the quiet chords played with smooth or detached notes? The answer is detached. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down towards the end. Did the piece end in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is minor. Number 9. Listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Where was the loudest point in the music? The answer is, in the middle. Did the change from quiet to loud playing happen suddenly or gradually? The answer is, gradually. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality. Was the beginning played smoothly or was it detached? The answer is smoothly. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it slowed down in the second half or near the end. Did the piece end in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is minor. Number 10. Listen to this piece. Then I'll ask you about dynamics and changes. Where was the quietest point in the piece? The answer is in the middle. Was the change from quiet in the middle to loud at the end made suddenly or gradually? The answer is gradually. Listen again. This time, I'll ask you about articulation, tempo, and tonality.
Were the notes smooth or detached? The answer is detached. Was there any change in the speed of the music or did it always stay the same? The answer is it stayed the same. Was the piece in a major key or in a minor key? The answer is major.